Welcome back to Send Crypto. Today is March 16th, 2019, and then the current price of Litecoin is 0.015 uh, BTC uh, on Binance, right? Uh, the current time is just about 11:35 Eastern time. So we're gonna talk about the Litecoin bar formation, and then uh, where do I think Litecoin is heading to at least for the short term? And then uh, we're mainly gonna take a look at Litecoin versus BTC because if you take a look at Litecoin USD, you're gonna, you know, uh, you're gonna uh, uh, you're going to be like a, you know, uh, making wrong decisions, right? And waiting for the bottom, basically. That's what I'm trying to say. So when you take a look at the bottom formation of BTC back in uh, 2015, BTC made this bottom formation, this W shape, right? Basically, let's take a look at it. I think it had a big drop just about this area, right? Let's say BTC was coming down, big drop, that, that, came back, retested, and then gone, right? So most people are waiting for this uh, bottom formation and uh, the reason why I say like BTC is not going to make a this type of bottom formation is most likely going to make a round bottom formation instead of a uh, uh, you know v-shaped a v-shaped bottom formation or a w bottom formation so most people are waiting for this bottom formation but when you take a look at Litecoin Litecoin has already bottomed right versus BTC at least for the short term right we could come back you know get a uh, get a support from this 50 AMA, but that's for the long term view. I will update the price later on. So, you take a look at the uh, bottom formation of Litecoin. It's the same bottom formation BTC made, but it made it like you know in a uh, 3D version. So, a 3D version, right? So, instead of making a flat version, look at how Litecoin made the uh, bottom formation. Just like that. I can give you like multiple uh, example, right? But another example I'm gonna give you is Tron, right? When you take a look at Tron, I'm gonna give you the chart of Tron. When you take a look at the bottom formation of Tron, first started like August, right? August all the way, all the way up to like first week of December, right? So look at the bottom formation of Tron. So some of the alt they making a a a, 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 a basically a horizontal bottom formation just like Tron, and some of the alt they make they making a uh, just like that, a, a not a vertical, but you know, a, a downward slope bottom formation. So you gotta keep that in mind, right? Tron, Tron and Litecoin get the same type of crossover. Litecoin is just about this area. So I don't even think like Litecoin is gonna come back and retest this 100 AMA. So, but we're just gonna have to wait and see. So let's go back and take a look at Litecoin once again. When you take a look at the uh, price action of Lit Litecoin right after the bottom formation, we got a clean crossover between the uh, 50 and then 100, right? So even if you go back like a uh, uh, if you go back uh, back in 2015 and then you take a look at the uh, price action of BTC after it bottomed, bottomed back in 2015, right? The BTC went up like almost like 106% and then came back retest this uh, area of, uh, you know, 50 AMA, right? The 50 AMA, I think on the weekly chart, supported BTC, right? And then BTC just started a bull run. Basically, Litecoin is repeating the same pattern, right? As BTC did back in uh, 2015. And then it's about to like go back to all-time high. So Litecoin is only about like 60% away from all-time high, right? So it's already up, right? Already up 130%, right? Now it's only like 60% away from all-time high. When you take a look at it, right? So only 60, only uh, just about this area, only 66% away from all-time high. So I think like Litecoin gonna go back to all-time high before end of the summer. Uh, you know, and then a slight pullback, wait for the, uh, the uh, you know, the the last quarter bull run, right? So that's my short term target from uh, Litecoin. Nice crossover between the 50 and then 100 MA. We're most likely going to come back down and then, you know, sometime this area, right? Uh, get, it's not going to be a, uh, it's not going to be a nasty pullback. It's going to be a very healthy pullback, right? So keep that in mind. So I'm, uh, I'm looking for Litecoin to come back sometime uh, before the summer. It's going to keep going up. Litecoin is very strong, right? We're going to take a look at also the, uh, uh, we're going to take a look at the RSI. When you take a look at the RSI, the current RSI level for Litecoin is 70, right? And then uh, most people are going to be uh, panicking very soon because of this divergence, but it doesn't mean anything. Litecoin is pretty strong, right? You take a look at this divergence, right? Between the uh, RSI and then, uh, the price right price is still moving up right take a look at price price is pretty strong right so most people are going to be anticipating a retest of the bottom but it's not going to happen right the reason why i say it's not going to happen because 
uh, I'm using Tron as a reference point, right? Tron has a one month divergence, like from uh, almost like December to like uh, Jan I mean February, right? Let's go ahead and take a look at the price action of Tron. When you take a look at the price action, price action of Tron, right? Same bottom formation as Litecoin, just in a uh, a linear fa li linear fashion, right? So Litecoin, you know, just to go back talk about Litecoin made this bottom formation, right? So let's see, Tron started, you know. Right, just about that area right that was just like late mid december right uh all the way up to uh let's see late january so look at this look at this uh let's take a look at it look at this divergence right so it lasts a uh, one month so if you if you don't know what you're doing right and then you know you, you're either gonna start selling right here and then as soon as you get as soon as you see like tron start uh tron start like to pull back you're gonna be like oh you know you know it's a bear market and then tron gonna come back retest this low litecoin gonna do the same thing but i don't think like litecoin gonna you know get this nasty you know uh pull back all the way down to this area so it is pretty healthy for uh, tron tron went up like 200 percent litecoin is only like up 130 percent right from uh from a december low like the first week of december right so it is pretty uh it is pretty interesting to uh look at you know the market as a 3d you know uh, market not like a uh, you know one-to-one -one, uh, everything you're looking at everything as a one-to-one -one ratio uh, BTC uh, bottom uh, you know get a flat bottom back in 2015 the rest of the market gonna get a, a flat bottom uh, in uh, 2019 right so the market has bottomed uh, even if you uh, the price of uh, these coins come back they're not gonna come back to these lows versus BTC so uh, the bull run is almost uh, yeah, it's almost about time for the bull run maybe another six to eight months before we you know all this coin gonna go like a thousand x you know uh you know twenty thousand x you know some of these coins tron gonna go like over thousand x two thousand x i mean i'm i'm not a big fan of tron but at least for the short term i know uh uh and I, I know it's it's bottom right I, I don't hate tron neither right so it's just like you know i, I really don't care i just accumulate right uh, i'm not a fanboy all right so that's about it for today let me know what you think about uh you know litecoin and tron and then uh you know uh you know wait if you think like uh, the market has bottom or uh, you know they're gonna come back and retest these lows right at least for the short term i'm gonna update the uh, tron price action uh, later on you know i'm still expecting tron to come back down to this area but it seems like tron uh, is pretty strong right is very strong it's holding very strong at this area of 50 uh uh 50 fibonacci right so uh, thank you for watching.